this car, bro. I'm on mega slouch for this one. What's up, guys? It's been a while. I haven't been filming a lot. Haven't been feeling my best uh, lately. So, sorry for that. Um, kind of bummed. I didn't film as much as I wanted to. Uh, but it is what it is, and the film we have is what we have. So I'm going to do my best in the next couple of videos to explain the happenings of like the last two-ish, three months. Me and my dad, we work really hard together to, uh, to do this YouTube stuff and to work on cars and to do what we do. And we really overloaded ourselves over the last like six months really. But the last three have been super difficult. <laughs> Recently, I rebuilt a set of side skirts for Evan Brown. Uh, he is the co-owner of Auto Handler. We painted Evan's car white a long time ago, and he came back to us before Drift Week 3, and he was like, hey guys, you want to help me fix my car? Because at that point, the front bumper had been blown into bits about three times, the side skirts were trashed, The like it, it needed a refresh standard drift car stuff um, so we were like yeah we'll, we'll help where we can and he brought us his rear bumper his rear over fenders and his side skirts I believe and I'll show you guys that stuff uh, now nice. what's up dudes? what's up I'm back, man. back for some refresh right on Hell yeah. yeah, so excited about that. Drift what Week camera 3, are you using? Oh, we're using a GoPro. It's a Hero 9. Oh, uh, that's what I want to get too. It's oh, hell yeah. Out, down, yeah, yeah it's, it's working all right this yeah, way. All right, all right. Yeah. yeah, we're working on this thing at the moment. It's the, the big project. Yeah, you got some drums on there, I see. Yeah, yeah, over yeah. fenders? Huh. Uh, yeah, we're going to do some metal fenders. <laughs> oh, what are those from? It's their. Fenders made by somebody who sells them on eBay, but we have a suspicion they might be somebody a little more well known than that. Oh, yeah. okay. Uh, we don't want to out them, but anyway. Damn man, got my frig man. All right, so here's what I was talking about with the my door wouldn't open, and I was at a drift event, so I just ground it down beneath right. where the door is. So I want to rebuild the edge like this one. Okay. So you think it'll work with the edge on this time around? Yeah, okay. I'm gonna re I'm gonna adhere it differently Just so it doesn't flex. Okay. okay. Um, and then not to put a lot of pressure on you or anything, but I'm gonna take these immediately over to have molds made. So, so whatever your finish work is is gonna be the right. mold for every single pair that I all make right. after. So that this. fingerprint uh, that we're gonna leave. Is that? Yeah, um, yeah exactly. Exactly. <laughs> was that? Was, oh, okay. Uh -huh. All right, dudes. All right. Thank you, man. Yeah, of Good course, man. You. Thank you guys so much. Be sick, dude. I'm not Thank gonna you. stick you with the whole car this time. It's so much fucking yeah. work. Dude, <laughs> so if you listen, if you listen closely, Evan says, "No pressure. Um, I'm gonna make molds of these," which was pretty funny because um, there's a lot of pressure, bro. <laughs> this. Yeah, these uh. Yeah, I, f I figured I could use something Maybe. like that. Um, yeah, Sam Squanch was actually the one who was like, yo, you should look at the bottom of those skirts. <laughs> they are not not the best. Yeah, they're, they're wavy, wavy hunks. Yeah. There, yeah. Oh, there you go. Now you can see the... Fuck. Yeah, it, they're super wavy, and I'm pretty sure Evan doesn't want that. So what I'm thinking is maybe we'll go to Home Depot and get like a two by four, like literally just get a board and like set it. I think we could just set these in there and just drape a huge piece over the bottom of it. And sure I think it'd be all right. Cause down. like, if you look like- You're talking about cutting this out? Lo the whole thing. Oh. The oh, whole yeah, yeah. bottom of this shit. Yeah, I think I'm, I'm, a, I'm a text Evan first and make sure that we're good to do that but I just, yeah after like taking a good hard look at the bottom of those I was like man these are not these are not what people want to pay 500 bucks for oh, whatever. like we whatever you pay you don't want that yeah. they're they're pretty Bowie yeah. <laughs> cut
Straight cut. We make straight cut. With the top of the side skirt remade now, remade, um, I say that loosely, but with it now existing on the side skirt, um, I'm going to move on to tackling the bottom side of these skirts. So earlier in the video, me and Sam Squanch were talking about how wavy the bottom of these skirts are. Like, if you look at the bottom of Corey's side skirts, they're straighter and they've been repaired many, 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 many times. If you look at the, the side skirts under them, the bottom of these side skirts, like, that's as flat as flat gets, bro. Um, these side skirts are from a much more expensive kit and they've never been broken before. So they look really, really good. But that being said, Evan's planning on making molds off of these side skirts as soon as they leave our garage. So yeah, I don't want him to, to be selling people wavy ass side skirts. That's not, that's not what he wants to do. That's not what, Nobody wants that. We've got a, a plan. <laughs> On the floor, there is a big ass piece of wood. Sam Squanch picked this up from Home Depot for me. Uh, thank you, Squanch. But basically what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna cut out the entire bottom of the side skirt and then I'm gonna screw this thing down and I'm gonna remake the bottom piece of it um, so that it's completely completely flat because as you can see right now it is all sorts of wavy bull crap we don't want those skirts to be wavy bro I'm trying to make nice pieces here so at the point where me and Sam Squanch decided that I was gonna it would be best for me to try to completely rebuild the bottom of the side skirts. Um, at that point, we were like a week behind on Corey's JZX project. And we just took on a new project from uh, another friend. And I had just like slung a chunk of metal into my eye. And so I was in like... I was in pain constantly. It wasn't like excruciating, but it was really obnoxious. And like when you can't see and you and it hurts and you, you can't do anything about it, it's it's super annoying. So that made the like the entire rest of the project just uh difficult. <laughs> Cause I had a chunk of metal sitting in my eye for all of it. I wanna go on record and say I didn't do this. The entire inside of this bad boy is caked with resin. You can see my finger is here, and this bad boy goes all the way back to here. It's like a half inch of resin coating the inside of the skirt. Just want to say, wasn't me. Was not your boy. I didn't do it. This guy right here uh, showed up while I was cutting all this stuff out. Um, Gotta fix these bad boys up good. Real good. I laid down some aluminum tape on the piece of wood that we're gonna be screwing the screwing the side skirt onto. And this is gonna give me a, uh, like a surface to uh, wax. So I've got some turtle wax here and I'm just gonna wax this whole bad boy. And so with this waxed, um, the idea is hopefully the, uh, the fiberglass will release nicely from the, the plank of wood once it's done curing. That way we'll just have a, a side skirt and a hunk chunk of wood and it'll be happy days. We'll see how it goes, but, uh, yeah, that's the idea. It's a lot of wax, bro. I want this shit to release. Whew. Whew. 
<laughs> yep, that's pretty thin, bro. Pretty ready for some gravy. So now I'm gonna screw the side skirt onto the wood boy. Hopefully this works. Joy. Joy. Man. I'm not nervous, bro. Nothing to be nervous about, bro. It's just fiberglass, bro. Bro. Psych. Bitch. Pussy. Dumbass. I ain't no fucking Bob the Builder, bro. I don't know what I'm doing when it comes to wood. I'm a car guy, bro. This is not going as well as I'd hoped. So there's just like a whole bunch of fuck shit going on. All right, so I took the side skirts off and I applied a couple more layers of wax just cause I was a little anxious about putting fiberglass over just one layer of wax. So hopefully this will be enough. It's gonna be a great time. Oh yeah. I'm gonna knock that over. Ran out of hardener and whatnot last night. So now we're hella stock and stuff. Um, ba -dum -bum -bum. Fucking close that bitch. Friendly reminder to put lids on your things. Cause uh, when you don't, stuff spills. Hey, I have a feeling Jonas is doing fiberglass. We should give him a call. Fiberglass is kinda messy, bro. Hit this one with the sauce. Straight. Oh shit, kind of fucking it up. It's fine, everything's fine. Nothing to worry about here. A little dabble over here, dabble over there action. The time has come. We're all dry. Um, you guys missed me come in here and I started lifting on it a little bit. I already took the screws out and it, part of it peeled up a little bit and I made a bunch of happy monkey noises. And now I'm gonna peel the rest of it off because I'm super excited. Kinda horrifying. Kinda awesome at the same time. Oh! Ooh, 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 ooh. There it is. <laughs> Fuck yeah, dude! Oh, we got it! Oh yeah, that's a side skirt, bro. Yeah. Woohoo! That's awesome, dude. It worked. What's up, guys? It's a new day. Uh, I've already gotten to work on the side skirts and I haven't updated you guys in a while. I went ahead and I laid quite a bit of fiberglass down on the ends. Evan wanted these guys flattened out a little bit because there was kind of a weird bump in there. Um, so I did that on both sides. Uh, I filled all of the holes that used to be used to, be, to mount the kit. And I filled the front side of this guy. And I, I sanded all of the the frizzy bits and super high spots off of um, off the fiberglass so that now we have two panels that we can start to block um, basically from here on out I'm gonna be using a block to uh, make sure this whole thing is flat as it can be and um, yeah real slick I am super happy with how they're coming out though you guys can see the bottoms of these skirts are nice and straight and uh, yeah they're just they're shaping up a lot better than uh, they would have if we had just you know fixed the cracks and called it a day these will be uh, a, a, a real decent piece and you know something you know I'd actually want to buy so it's cool
I spent so many hours sanding these side skirts that I never actually filmed myself sanding the side skirts because the entire time I was like, man, I have so much more sanding to do, I'll film it later. And, uh, yeah, but I spent a long time blocking and adding filler and blocking and adding filler and blocking and adding filler. Um, a lot more time than I expected, but, yeah. Okay. It's probably been, like, four or five hours of blocking the bottom of these side skirts and probably four or five layers of fiberglass filler around the edges um, just to flatten out the bottoms. I've also put some fiberglass filler on the front end caps uh, to kind of flatten them out. I just added these two little pieces of fiberglass uh, about an hour and a half ago. And it looks like they are dry, which is good news. All right, so Evan's skirts are just about ready to go for paint. They uh, they look good. I spent way, way, way too much time on these things, and uh, I'm happy with them. Shown us blocked for literally days on this, and they look. I hope they come out once we get paint on it. Sometimes we get surprised, but they're so much different than they were. <laughs> Way too much time. But also yeah. awesome that it happened. Oh, these things. This is all new. He built this. That was a different shape. It's made like this so that it'll come out of the mold right. Cut so it looks decent on the end much wider at the bottom than it was so it should be stronger it's cool hopefully we'll see yeah yeah so uh go follow uh evan on instagram and when he starts selling these uh buy a pair because that'd be cool but don't tell him if you don't like the quality yeah don't tell me about that <laughs> don't talk to me about that shit. it's great <laughs> just smile and wave <laughs> <laughs> no they're good Nah, no, they're, they're, they're good. They're good sunscreens. At the end of the day, the piece that me and Sam Squanch delivered to Evan is a piece that I'm, I'm really proud of. And after seeing the response from the E36 community, um, I just like, it makes me feel good. Like, I worked really hard to make those side skirts look super nice, and, and people seem to be really excited about them. And I don't know, I'm just, that's cool. That's cool to me. So, uh, I thought this video was kind of funny. Uh, I'm really happy to share it with you guys. I hope you guys got, got something from it too. And, um, the JZX is done. It's gone. And I have a couple videos to edit and release to you guys from that. It came out better than I could have imagined. And, uh, I'm excited to show that to you guys. Hope you guys have a good one, and uh, we got a lot of stuff going on 
in the near future, and I hope you guys stick around to watch it, because I, I like filming videos, and, and this, is what, this is what I like to do, man. This is the fun stuff. Have a good day, guys. Thanks for watching. Uh, make sure to leave a like or a comment, and subscribe.